This is a Game Caviar production. Wow. Not having any Game Caviar Studios. Remember the couple days ago, a couple videos ago, I was talking about how I bought Borderlands and then they were giving out Borderlands for free. And I was like, damn, I missed out. I wasted my money. This is Borderlands 2. And I logged on to PS3 and they were having a Borderlands 2 sale. This is like the third time Borderlands 2 has been on sale. And, I've, and the other two times I've skipped out on it. I'm a big fan of Borderlands, the first one, and I've heard nothing but great things about the second Borderlands. I just hadn't had a chance to get around to buying it until now. It was on sale for like uh, $24 or something for PlayStation Plus members, and then uh, since I was a loyal customer, Sony sent me a... A, uh, a coupon code or voucher code or whatever for ten dollars that I just had sitting in my account and so I used all of that to get Borderlands 2 now I think that this was a good deal first of all the game is still very new uh, well not very new but it's still new and second of all I don't think that I'm going to log on next week and they're going to be handing it out for free. So I don't think I'll repeat the same mistake of uh, Borderlands 1. And I get a really cool game for a really low price. And in my world, that's always a good deal. So I'm just doing my thing right now, trying to get uh, leveled up and work through the storyline and... I got to deal with claptrap shit. I didn't. I, I don't really like claptraps. I think they're annoying. But anyway, you have to deal with them in the game. And I, you know, if I had to deal with it, I'd deal with it. Whatever. Some of the games that are coming up. Well, one game in particular that I'm really looking forward to is that Far Cry 3 Blood Dragon. I have not been a real big fan of Far Cry, the series in general. I haven't played the third one, so I can't speak on that one. But I know I hated the second one. And that was the main reason why I didn't get the third one. But <clears throat> they do have a standalone Far Cry game called Blood Dragon. It's not a DLC, meaning that it's not dependent on you having Far Cry 3. You can just buy this, download it, and play through it. And it's basically an 80s version of Far Cry 3 with lasers and awesome music and and um, and everything that goes along with the uh, whatever you think of that comes up with with 80s. You know, they have videos up and uh, you should check it out. They have like a 15 minute video of somebody playing and it shows the mechanics and going through it and shooting motion and everything. It's a really good first person shooter and. With me being born in the 80s, I can understand how uh, people that were born in that same time frame would understand and appreciate the, the move, the way that they're going uh, with that standalone game. I hope they make it into a full-length game, you know, like this is Far Cry Blood Dragon, Far Cry 3 Blood Dragon, or just call it Blood Dragon. I mean, I don't care. I want. I can't wait. It comes out on May first, and you could get it on PlayStation Three, Xbox Three Hundred and Sixty, and PC. I don't know which one I'm gonna get it on, but I know I'm going to get that game, and it's gonna be amazing. So you could definitely expect to see some videos about that. And in the meantime, check it out. Check out the video on YouTube because uh, it's like it's more than just one, so you shouldn't have a problem finding it. Just search for. Uh, Blood Dragon or Far Cry 3 Blood Dragon and you'll see how awesome that game really is so it's just like Far Cry but it's everything is all 80s out and it's all uh what is it it's, it's really over the top with everything that goes along with it which is cool because that that right there is like it, it reminds me of an old arcade game you know I don't know whether how many of you have ever been to arcade before but I, I've spent plenty of quarters in arcade games and that and that this Blood Dragon seems like an old arcade game mixed up with all of the nostalgia that comes with playing like Super Nintendo and Nintendo and all of those old consoles, Sega Genesis and, and things like that. So it's kind of like a walk down memory lane for me and I'm really glad that they're going to come out with that game. So May 1st is going to be it. I'm going to be all over that game. 
I'm going to be playing the hell out of that game. And there's going to be plenty of videos on Game Caviar. But anyway, this has been Borderlands 2, PlayStation 3. I'm not having it in the Game Caviar Studios. And I'm out. This has been a Game Caviar production. Like this video and subscribe for more.